Happy Sunday, you two. Happy Sunday. We are miraculously all ready to go to church, basically on time. I had to dovetail the laundry so that it was ready to put into the dryer around the time we left, and it was close. Like, there's two minutes left on it. We need to leave in like three minutes, and it has like their blankies, their sleep sacks, like everything that they're gonna need for a nap. When Basically, when we get back home, we eat lunch and then go down for a nap. So, it needed to be done. Bear, what are you doing, buddy? Thank you. Okay, uh, so we're all ready. I'm gonna get them loaded up into the car. Thank you. Let me hold that one too, thank you. We need to figure out a system for their shoes. I'm thinking just a basket, but then I feel like it'll just be a basket full of shoes, so I haven't decided. Um, I forgot what I was saying. Yeah, so I'm gonna get them loaded in the car and then switch the laundry over to the dryer so that it's nice and dry when we get home. Come on, Lindell. Bug, you're right, bug. Lindell, ew, what did you just eat? What did you just eat? Mommy. That's bear shoe. Can I see what you have in your mouth? I can't see. Ew. Let me take that. Thank you. I think that's dog food. Okay. All right. We have an escapee. Rusty, you're not coming to church, buddy. Sorry. All right. This is cute. Our nanny drew a bear that looks, I get gets more like a cat or a cat that looks more like a bear. I'm not sure. <laughs> and then this is their artwork. Looking good, guys. Uh-oh, we left your Bapadol out, didn't we? Oopsie. <laughs> Oopsie. <laughs> I used to think putting new sheets or clean sheets on the bed was hard with cats. It's way harder with two toddlers. <laughs> like the whole time I was putting the sheets on the bed, they were both standing right here going uppy, uppy, which is up, up please. Uppy. Whoa, you're gonna fall off, buddy. You gotta be careful. Be careful. It's so fun. Um, speaking of cats, today's Sunday. Brad comes back Tuesday. I'm so happy. All things considered, the two weeks went well. Like the kids were happy most of the time. It was just really difficult. I mean, just being like six months pregnant wasn't ideal. I was just, it was a lot. Like it was, I, and if Brad wasn't, I think I've mentioned this many times, if he wasn't so hands-on and involved, it wouldn't have been as much of a shock. But we had fun, didn't we guys? Yes, we did. <laughs> <laughs> oh, I said I started that by saying speaking of cats. Um, so he'll be back Tuesday and then we'll officially be moving the cats here, which will bring a whole other element of the craziness that we have going on here. Yeah. You are silly. They don't have pants on. I feel like we're always justifying why the kids don't have pants on. We were just playing in the swimming pool outside and they both like dipped their shorts in the pool. So took them off because they're wet. We're getting ready to eat dinner soon, and then it's bedtime, and it's just like not worth putting a fresh pair of shorts on him. <laughs> Where's Lindell? Where's Lindell? Dishes! Never before have I been more excited to have seasonal ingredients pre measured, delivered right to my door weekly, and easy to follow instructions so that I can whip up dinner without any thought and it's gonna be delicious. Thank you, HelloFresh. So I have Aunt Lala outside watching the babies. My mom is here also. Uh, super thankful for extra hands to keep them entertained tonight while I cook dinner. That's probably been the hardest thing is like, um, just not being able to keep them happy while I'm trying to get dinner on the table. But with HelloFresh, the meals come together in less than 30 minutes, and that means minimal cleanup after you're done making dinner, which is really awesome because after they go to bed and it's time to clean up, I don't wanna be doing a whole bunch of dishes. So what's also cool is you have a variety of choices when you're picking out which meals you want. Um, you can choose a classic plan, a family plan, or a veggie plan, and it gives you some examples of each of those, just depending on what your preferences are. We usually do the classic or the family, but 
And I haven't done the veggie yet, but I think maybe we'll try that next time. And I've talked about doing it before and we just haven't done it. But um, yeah, so just depending on what your preferences are, you can, you can um, cater your plan to that. So you guys know that we've been using HelloFresh for well over a year now, and it's just so nice having it come to our house week after week. Uh, I just can't overstate how convenient it is. HelloFresh is now from $6.99 per serving. If you wanna get started with HelloFresh, America's number one meal kit, you can get eight free meals. That's $80 off your first month at HelloFresh. So if you haven't signed up for it yet, as Brad would say, what are you waiting for, Christmas? Uh, but all you have to do is go to HelloFresh.com and enter promo code Brad and Rach 80 and you'll get that eight free meals on your first month. So go check it out. Let us know which, which meals that you get and what you think. Lots of excitement around here. Brad told me last night when we were talking on the phone. So today is Monday. He was scheduled to come home on Tuesday. He texted, or we, call, we were talking on the phone yesterday, Sunday evening and he's like I don't even want to tell you this because if it doesn't happen you'll just be really disappointed. Turns out um, some of the guys that were flying out were leaving today Monday in the afternoon to catch their really early flights tomorrow and so Brad's like well if they're leaving to catch early flights I'm just driving home like is it cool if I go because otherwise he's literally just staying there to stay the night wake up, eat breakfast, and come home. Like there's nothing else they were doing. They had closing ceremonies already done. So they said, eventually they said yes. And then it was like, eh, maybe not, because like the, a lot of the people that are there right now are Air Force, and the Air Force apparently is more lenient on stuff like that than the Navy and Brad's Navy. So they had to get it cleared through the Navy. And he's like, I just don't know if they're gonna clear it. So anyway, we got final confirmation that he is coming home. He'll be here in less than an hour. We're so excited. I've got the babies out here getting stuff ready. We popped a balloon already? Yeah. Oh my gosh. He's biting them. We have a welcome home daddy sign. We've got yellow balloons, which are not safe for kids to have for that very reason. Yep. Um, Trying to find the rest of it. <laughs> you can't bite a balloon, buddy. They're being closely supervised with these balloons. Yes but we're gonna get everything ready to welcome daddy home. We kind of need to put a balloon over that label on the, we didn't have any really actual poster, so I'm using this, this eye, poster of the eye. <laughs> Hopefully Brad doesn't mind, that's actually his. I'll give it to you, but you can't bite it. No biting, no eating it, okay? I tell ya, what are they, toddlers? I know. Good. Balloon. Don't oh, Lindell, don't bite it. What is that? Is that a balloon? Balloon. Lindell, can you? Can you? Ah! Ah! <laughs> no. Don't bite it. <laughs> Lindell, can you say balloon? Can you kick it? Bear? Say balloon. Don't bite it. Don't bite it, bear. bear. Boo bear. Uh uh. No biting. <laughs> You're. Put it on the ground and kick it. Say balloon. Put it down. Kick it. Kick it. Balloon. No. Balloon. <laughs> Watch. Grandma's going to kick it. Ooh, this is going to be fun. Kick it. Uh-huh. Kick go. it. Kick it. Whoa! Can you kick it, Bear? Can you kick it? Kick, kick it! Woo! <laughs> okay, I'm gonna get the cars pulled out of the driveway. Yay! So we're just waiting for you know who. They don't know. I haven't told them. <laughs> I haven't told them that he's coming home today instead of tomorrow. So this will be a real shock to them. Yes. It bears on an important business call, Lindell. Bea. 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 Bea.
Bye. I feel like this is really gonna make a big impression. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> yep, that is a piece of art. <laughs>